forget about our appointment, did ya? Ball sack. Trying to avoid us. Big mistake. Huge mistake. You think if you just hang back while everyone else leaves for home, that we'd what? I think you already left. No, it wasn't anything like that, Brody. Kevin, I just had. You must think we're pretty stupid, huh? <laughs> Come on, guys. It was funny the first four times, and now it's just getting old. Blah blah blah. <laughs> now it's just getting old. Man, this would be a whole lot better forever if your breath didn't smug inside of a dog's ass. You know what? I think I have a breathman in here somewhere. <laughs> Pony. You know what? Maybe we should switch it up. He dug his head the shitter. <laughs> Fine. Put me in the locker, but this time, I'm keeping my pants. Yeah, like you're in a position to be making demands. What an idiot. I just want to note it, I went willingly and without a- Shut up! Can I at least get a snack? I'm starving! Maybe you can snack in that attitude instead. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't even make any sense! <laughs> hey, ball sack. While you're in there, make sure you don't mess with any of my stuff. <laughs> Haha, <laughs> ha, very funny guys. Okay, you proved your point. I'm a loser. Now open up. Guys? Come on, guys. Brody, Kevin, guys, get me out of here. Guys? Hello? Somebody? Anybody? I'm stuck in a locker. Damn it, mom's gonna kill me now. She's probably already pissed for making her wait this long in the parking lot. What was I thinking? Why didn't I just leave with everyone else? No, I had to be the smart guy and wait. God, what am I stepping in? Why could I be put into Kevin's locker? At least this locker is clean, smells like cinnamon, and it has way more room to move around in. Oh, what's that smell? I'm going to barf. It smells like burnt broccoli and sweaty jock straps in here. God, what's touching my leg? Ew, this sucks. Can't believe it. You'd think somebody somewhere would have thought to put a safety lever in here, but no, why would they? I mean, they have them on freezers, and when was the last time someone actually got stuck in one of those? This is bullshit. I can't believe this is happening to me. After all the progress man has made, the discovery of fire, putting a man on the moon, the invention of video games, the only thing that hasn't evolved in like a gazillion years is the bully, the quintessential jerk. I wouldn't be surprised if you look back throughout history and you'd always find a Brody and Kevin somewhere lurking, ready to pounce and shit on someone's day. Chance we should celebrate by dousing his crown in a pot of our celestial excrement. I'll remain with the cage. <laughs> Not again, my good man. Yarr. Maybe we should take this scallywag and dunk his wee head into thy poop deck, if you savvy my drift. It seems you have me over a barrel. <gasps> <laughs> Not again! By the moons of Gork, we can plant Amartine's cranium into the defecation extractor. I will compute with your commands. <gasps> <laughs> Good old mom, thank god I can always count on you. No, 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 no! Damn it. Gotta be kidding me! Oh, come on. Oh, what the? Ew! That's the most disgusting thing ever! Oh, gross! Oh, damn it, what the hell is that? Son of a... Man, one day I'm gonna throw those guys a wicked beating. I should've taken Taekwondo instead of those stupid swimming classes. How many life and death situations are there where someone backstrokes their way to have a surprise attack in a dark alley? Come on guys, let me out of here. I'm gonna die near starvation next to, uh, what is that, a shoe? A bag? Of all the days to skip lunch. Oh. 
What is that? What is that? Ah! Oh my god, a mouse! Oh my god! Get the hell out of here! I hate my... Get off! Get... Oh my god. Oh my god. Was that a mouse? Is there a hole in here? Oh my god. Ew. Guys, get me out of here. I'll probably get rabies. <laughs> oh, thank god. Hey! If I knew these stupid romance novels you read were filled with so much sexiness, I'd have started reading a long time ago. Oh, that's weird, Miss Ralston, Mr. Stevenson. It's like, it's like another world that's filled with passion and love and lust. Well, someone so sweet and innocent like you wouldn't. <gasps> Holy shit, Mr. Stevens is getting wild. Mr. Heathcliff. Shut up. Shut up, you're ruining it. <laughs> oh, ow. Uh, I got it. Just turn it. I got it. Turn it counterclockwise. No, counterclockwise. <laughs> Great. 
Now you can add cultural studies to the classes I'm failing. When Mrs. Sheffield asked me why I didn't do my history through the eyes of mass media homework, I'll just simply say, well, I was going to do it all, but Mr. Stevenson's splooge was all over the 1987 periodicals. I'm sure she'll completely understand and give me an A just for bringing this to everyone's attention. Now how am I going to... Oh my god, not again! Not again! What is that? Oh, thank God. Hey, hey, janitor! I'm stuck in this locker. Hey, janitor, hello? Hello? Mister? Hey, I'm stuck in this locker. Please, some stupid kids put me in here. What is up with this school? It's like I'm trapped in some weird high school porno musical. Hey, janitor! Hello? Come back here, you hear me? Let me out! If you let me out, I'll, I'll help you clean up after school. I'll mop, dust, whatever, but I'm not going near the periodicals. I'll, I'll come back, please. Damn it. That's just great, just great. Where the hell is that smell coming from? It smells like a porta potty in here. I'm going to barf. I'm actually going to barf. Oh my god. Oh, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, no, 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 no. Great, and I just got this phone. What? What? Who's there? Hello? Hello? Who's there? Hey, kid. Hey, kid. Hey, kid, over here in the locker. Follow my voice. Look over here. Look to your right. To your right. I'm in the locker. Hey, kid, you gotta get me out of here. What? I need you to take this lock off and get me out of here. You gotta be kidding me. I'm being hunted here. Hey, come on, man. All you gotta do is take the lock off. That's it. That's all I'm asking. Oh, uh, I don't know, man. I'm wasting precious of time just talking. I'm on the run. No, no, no. Wait. Come on, man. If this was you, I'd totally help you out. No, no can do, bro. No can do, bro. No can do, bro. Uh, what are you, a niner? Wait, you're not even a niner. You're that, that brainy kid who skipped like two grades. That makes you a, a seven or something. Sevener isn't even a word. Well, you listen here, Sevener. I'm in grade 10, so that means I outrank you in every way. So you have to open this door. And if you don't, when I get out. If you get out. When I get out, I'll. Uh, y you'll be sorry, because I'll. I'll find so some things for. Oh my god. Sorry, man. Every man for himself. Geek's Code of Conduct. No, you didn't just recite Geek's Code of Conduct. I invented Geek's Code of Conduct. Now open this door. Open it. <laughs> Gotta go. Niner, you asshole. You always be nothing but a big ass stain in life. Maybe. No, no, the asshole's not gonna work, guys. You little. <laughs> I hope they dunk your head in the shitter. Get him. That little asshole in that way. Get shit, him. Ball sack.
Jerks! I'll probably die in here. Maybe in a hundred years from now, some dumb kid will find my scraggly bones and mistakenly think they belong to some small little girl. They'll hang my scrawny bones in the science lab, and Brody and Kevin's mutant kids will probably steal my... my fibula, and, and clone my DNA Martin. just so that they can shove me in a cryogenic chamber. Uh, that would probably... Martin. Mom! Mom, over here! Mom! Martin? Mama, I'm in the locker! Mom, over here! Follow my voice! Martin, where are you? In this locker, right here. No, this one, over here. Martin? Mom! I, Martin, I've been waiting outside forever. Why didn't you answer your phone? <sighs> Mom, you're killing me. Just open the door. <sighs> Where's your shoe? <sighs> what was I stepping in? It smelled like... <gasps> oh my gosh! Ew! I was stepping in that. I'm gonna barf. I'm gonna barf. What is that? Ew, what is that? Oh, that is disgusting. I am going to barf. That sock is not coming home with us. You no, know, you would think someone would think to put a safety release in here. That's what I said. Honey, just get your important stuff and let's go. Come on, honey, let's go. Is this Brody and Kevin again? Jesus, this is ridiculous. I'm signing you up for that Taekwondo. What? Oh, come on, Mom, I don't need Taekwondo. That's because you're worried it's gonna cut into your video game time. No, that's not it at all. It's just that Taekwondo's so old school. Today it's all about mixed martial arts. Kimuras, arm bars, uh, ground and pound. Uh, I already told you, no more mixed martial whatever. It makes you hyper. <sighs> come on, honey, we're already late for your swimming lessons. <sighs> oh, geez, just leave me just in the locker. come on. Mr. Stevenson's face all over. Ew, Mom, you should have heard what she's gonna do to him. Well, I am sure as hell never baking any more cakes for that woman. And you're never stepping foot in that library again, let alone the periodical section. Wow, your school is so weird. You're telling me. Well, it's about time. This is ridiculous. What am I, your personal chauffeur? And if you keep putting your brother in lockers, he is going to end up with scoliosis. What then, huh? What then? Sorry, Mom. 